Three governors placed under watch by security agencies over plot to destabilize Nigeria. Three seven governors in Nigeria are currently under watch by security agencies over an alleged plot to incite violence that may engulf parts of the country, according to Vanguard. The governors who are in their final term in office are reportedly from the northeast, the north central, and the south south geopolitical zones of the country. The three governors, according to information, reportedly met in a secret location and mapped out their plan to stage a nationwide protest that would take the form of the 2020 NSAS protest. The goal is to make Nigerians kick against the current administration of President Muhammad Buhari and its failures under the plot which his former security agency is monitoring. The Northeast governor is to kick start the groundwork for the planned mass protest with a meeting with key stakeholders from the north in Kaduna with the allegation that the governors had marginalized certain groups in his state and should be rejected in the 2023 police. The Kaduna meetings, according to the security agency, discussed in details how to mobilize a great Nigerian student who had been forced to stay at home due to ongoing strike by the economic Academic Staff Union of Universities, ARSO. The civil society and politicians are to join the planned mass protest to register the kind of impact that the 2022 protests recorded nationwide. A top security official who is monitoring the situation claimed that while they were not against freedom of association and protest, they were worried the planned protests would escalate into national violence that would be difficult to control. It is for this reason that our agency and sister security organizations have placed the three governors under constant watch and we are going to monitor their activities to ensure that they do not plug the nation into an avoidable crisis, the senior official of the Nigerian government said on Saturday night. We have also deployed our men to flashpoint to ensure that the country is not pushed into big problem by these politicians who have eventually come to the end of their tenure and do not care if the country burns or not. Okay. Hmm. Oh my God. Anybody who wants to carry out peaceful protest is free to do so. They should not mind any politicians who used to use against who used to use against the masses but we later cry of poor salary like policemen did after using them against answers protests what a great leader of nigeria president muhammad buhari hmm. the security operatives and the service chief must be influenced must be under influence of drugs with the situation of the country, no reasonable person would support President Muhammad Buhari and his useless policy. Was this country stable? The last thing has electricity, which has so many alternatives, is not even stable. There is solar, generating sets, hydro, wind power, etc. But is this the, the last uh, latest stable the last stable i beg your pardon how much more fuel that is only crude oil and leadership that is mainly corrupt okay guys sorry about that these are reactions by nigerians i i got it funny difficult to get the weddings the man you kept in Asu rock have already destabilized nigeria ha mumu deo they should look too far at all when normal citizens who are already frustrated and angry with Nigeria's situation, are ready and willing to Kukuma destabilize the whole unstable Nigeria. So you do better keep your eyes to over all the citizens. Okay? 
Anybody who speaks the truth in this country now is trying to destabilize the country. The same security agents who don't know how bandits are entering the country. Hairs are set to rule. The certain governors will cry blood, don't die in their war. The ones they are with, how far, even the money and the properties they claim they have recovered, where are the money and the properties? Apart from the governors from the Middle Belt and the Southern Nigeria, they tell me any governor they are investigating talk more of trying them or due constitutions is our problem. Okay, Nigeria is already sitting on the cage of a gun power. A gunpowder, any attempt to arrest any governor from the south based on this, hmm, with fleecy excuses, we spread doom on the country. Less better, it's better to let the sleeping dog lie. Nigeria is close to break. The three governors are simply Mwike of the River State, Mr. Autumn of Benue State, and governor of Taraba State. This is pure plain of winch heart. Hmm, someone just said that. I am sure Benue and Taraba, among them, they use Christian militants extensively to create smoke cover for their corruptive tendencies. Okay, Akira Dolu governor of Ondo State, we know you will be their target for standing for the truth and justice. Did I just hear our security agents speak? as if they are speaking for the ruling party. Which way, Nigeria, when the security apparatus no longer work for betterment of the populace, but for the ruling party? And this is the worst part of it. Nigerian security is always raising alarm. Nigerians protest this and this and that. But they will not raise alarm, you know, or find that how the Boko Haram are getting their information, targeting our Nigerian army and killing civilians, burning properties in the north, northern part of the country. And they are talking as if they are not in Nigeria. Are they not experiencing whatever thing that is going on? You see, all this eye service and pretense will never take us go far. If you don't tell these leaders the truth, they will know. That is the truth. They won't change. When someone is doing something that is not right, correct the person, not by covering up and all this high service, which by the end of the day, no, I'm not going to see they cry foul. Not even I see they cry, say they know they pay salary. I say police people, they cry. I myself, they cry. Say their salary, not they come, you know, uh, are due, whatever. See, all of us are getting it. If you like, continue to pretend. The truth is that all of us are getting the heat. Nigeria is not working and is affecting everybody. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts with us below the comment section. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you very much for having you here. Bye for now.